We're almost at Lazarus Port. Are you ready to disembark? Then let us head back. Attention, everyone! We will shortly be docking at Lazarus Port. It has been an honor sailing with you. You are all to relax and enjoy yourselves after this strenuous voyage. That is all. With a heavy heart, Zale pondered his options as the fleet approached the island. Excellent work as always, General. A wonderful result. Thank you, Milady. You lot, stop right there! Huh. What are you doing? What is this? Zale! I've discovered that this man, using the chaos to his advantage, tried to abduct Lady Callista. I also have information stating that these people helped the Garak, allowing them to steal our precious magical tones. What? You're wrong. Uncle, they wouldn't. My poor Callista. Did they threaten you? You're safe now. No need to worry. Throw them in the dungeon! Sir! Hold still! What are you doing? Let me go! General Astar? You wouldn't want to tarnish your good name by defending them, would you? Zale! Zale and the others protested in vain as they were taken to the dungeon beneath the castle. There, they found that Lowell and Siren had already been imprisoned. I see. So our little friend turned out to be the Count's niece. But Zale saved that girl's life. I'm pretty sure that kind of thing shouldn't land you in the slammer. It's that damn Jarrell. No doubt he's been filling the Count's head with ideas. I'll wager you were infamous throughout the castle by now. That's one way to make a name for ourselves. I got you all into this. I'm sorry. Ah, it ain't your fault. If it comes down to it, we can bust out. Oi, there'll be no busting out. It's not like the Count believes everything Jarrell tells him. But he won't ignore an accusation from his future nephew, either. Which is why we have to be patient. Someone called Dagron here. The Count wants a word. What did I tell you? I'll see what I can do. Just sit tight. Callista helped us so much. I promised I'd rescue her. Now look at me. There's nothing I can do. Damn it! I heard there's a... there must be some... course they found me. Just what have they got?
Are you Zale? You're gonna be questioned. Get out. Hurry up! What's that sound? Ah, this is where we lock up the monsters we capture. Sometimes, we feed some unruly prisoners to them. A harsh interrogation awaited Zale. He was charged with taking advantage of the Gurak assault to kidnap Callista and allowing the Gurak to sneak into the castle. My Lord Inquisitor, I witnessed this man and Lady Callista having a little conversation away from the ball. You seem to be on quite familiar terms with the lady. Tell me, was that the first time you liaised with her? That's... <laughs> I thought not. You've been trying to get close to her for some time, fueled by some unsavory motive, no doubt. You're wrong! I wouldn't... The accused will refrain from speaking out of turn. He will respond only when asked a direct question. This man was ordered to take Lady Callista somewhere safe. By General Astar. At that time, there was no one he could entrust with the task. Except for that man. Hmm. But you did not see the two of them after that, correct? I know what I saw. I saw this man trying to whisk Lady Callista away. Against her will, naturally. That's a lie, and you know it! You ran off as soon as the attack started! You dare to sully my noble name. Commoner! Noble! All I see is a coward! The accused will mind his tongue! And your misdeeds certainly did not end there. You claim to have sneaked aboard a Garak warship and taken it over. If so, then why did you not simply escort Lady Callista back right away? What reason could there possibly have been to put the Fair Maiden in any further danger? That's because... Lord Giral is correct, young man. Have you anything to say? You managed to rescue everyone else? I put it to you that the only reason was that you wanted to kidnap her. No, you're wrong! You're going to have to do better than that. You won't defend yourself? My Lord Inquisitor, I believe we are wasting our time trying to get the truth from this commoner. Perhaps we should proceed in a manner befitting his status. Indeed. If he will not answer, then there is only one course of action. This is delicious. It seems the commoner has had enough. 
Nothing more we can do now. Let us adjourn. Take him to his cell. Your stubbornness merely prolongs your agony. You should know your station. Damn. Nothing for it. Come on, then. I told you, you can't handle that sword yet. I'm fine. I can do this. Be strong. Nah. Looks like he's awake. Those rotten bastards! They really messed you up! I've healed you as best I can, but don't overdo it. At Jiral! He's been telling everyone how he slaughtered a hundred Garak. But it's all lies. He stood at the back whimpering while we did all the fighting. He'd rather that wasn't known, so he had me thrown in here. Not a decent bone in his body. We didn't do anything wrong. We can't yield to these baseless accusations. A lot's changed here since the current Count arrived. If anyone says a bad word against him, bang, you end up here. <sighs> I miss the days of the old Count. Oh no, I was meant to be on a date with that noble girl. Crap! Huh. Haven't we met before? Never mind. What are you in here for? Well, uh... They caught me sneaking into a nobleman's mansion. Oh, a burglar. No, I am not a burglar. But my most precious treasure was taken from me. I couldn't stand idly by. I tried to deal with it lawfully, but my social status is a trifle low. They wouldn't deal with someone of my standing. I see. Sounds like we're in the same boat. You fellows too? You certainly don't seem like bad people. Maybe you could help me with something. Such as? Oh, um, uh, better to show you when the guard is gone. They just chucked us in here before we knew what was going on. Trapped in the dark with no way out. The story of my life. It seems like the guard has gone. So what is it? Take a look at this. I've been digging a hole. I'm an archaeologist, so I know about geology and old buildings. I thought there was something odd about this wall, and I wasn't disappointed. <laughs> we can get out of here. Well, monsters live in there, so I couldn't do much good on my own. But you look like you can take care of yourselves, so... Care to help?
So what is it? Take a look at this. So what is it? Take a look at... We can get out. But you look... Oh, happy day! I knew you would. Let's go down there right away. I'll stay behind. Go once the guards disappeared. See you later. Guided by Horace, the mercenaries attempted their escape. However, there wasn't much time before the guard would return. They had to make haste. I swear, all these caves look the same to me. It seems the geology of the island is such that it was very easy to dig these caves. We should hurry. Time is of the essence. Horus, this is a dead end. Hmm, curious. I'm sure it shouldn't be. Let's take a look around. Sail, the guard might come back soon. We should hurry. It's dark in here, so don't stray too far from me and my lamp. It's dangerous. Hmm, that wall. What is it, Master Zail? There's something strange about that wall. Leave it to me. I'll take a look. I had a certain feeling about this wall. Call it my archaeologist's intuition. If we look around, there might be more places like this. Right. Let's keep at it. Ha! I've still got it! Hmm. That wall. Horace, could you take a look at that wall? That wall there? Hmm, let's see. A bit nippy in here. I think it's colder further in. You alright, Moranya? I'm fine. <gasps> a well here? Curious. It's just a well. That's not so weird, is it? It is, Ale. It would be difficult to use in a place like this. You're right. I suppose it would be hard to get any water through that passage. Something's a bit whiffy. Uh, really? Hmm, that wall. Horace, could you take a look? That wall there. Hmm, that wall. Horace. That wall. Ooh. Seems this spring is brimming with a mysterious energy. Oh, huh? 
I can feel all that prison grime washing away. you take a look at this wall? That wall there? Hmm, let's see. Ooh. Rather creepy. I agree. The decor is ghastly. Ooh. Ooh. What in the world is that? I'll go. Stay out of sight. This doesn't feel right. Be careful, Zale.
Ooh, this place is remarkably eerie. It's so dark, I can hardly see. Oh, help me! Oh, it's just a rock. Let's take a look around. Curiosity killed the cat, you know? It's only a little look. I wonder where he gets his confidence from. Oh. Evil, surging through here. Something is controlling the souls of the dead. Oh, who would do such a thing? There's no use standing around here shouting. Let's find it. Could you take a look at that wall? That wall there? Hmm, let's see. Ooh! That wall. Horace, could you take a look at that wall? That wall there? Hmm.
Hmm, that wall. Horace. That wall. Ooh. That will... Excellent! More treasure! <gasps> At least a minor concussion. Don't move! We'll come down! Leaving Horace leaving Horace alone probably isn't very nice. Probably. Now then. My archaeologist's blood is racing. It seems there are quite a few mysteries on this island. Horace, aren't we just going deeper and deeper? Will this really help us escape? Uh, of course. See, wind is coming from further inside. If there's wind, then there must be an exit to the surface somewhere. Wouldn't you say so? Well, that does make sense. You're the scientist. Sorry I doubted you. Not at all. Something evil is close. Very close indeed. It's... using some kind of ancient magic to control the souls. You can sense that. Well, an archaeologist has to know these things. I suppose I might have misjudged you, Horace. Think nothing of it. Hmm... that coffin looks pretty fishy. Let's have a look. Ah, oh, here it is.
fuck! Horace, Horace! Calm down and light a lamp. Right, Master Zale. It got away. The aura in here is different from before. It's conjecture, but I would say this is an ancient tomb. So then that thing we fought was some kind of guardian? It would appear that we've unwittingly become tomb robbers. It was enjoying a long sleep until we showed up. Nonetheless, it'd be a bit silly to go back now. Indeed, we must press on and find a way out of here. Let's go. It's in here. Indeed. What? Me? Okay, if you say so. Instant movement! Alright for some! No time for glib remarks! Just keep trying to hit it!
kill. We can use this, Master Zael. What is it? A very special treasure. A little wall of ice will pose no challenge to the powers of this stone. Looks like a Garak sunstone to me. Exactly! Very astute of you. Go on, give it a try. Ha! I knew it! The exit should be up ahead. Let's hurry. Huh? And what do we have here? A dead end? Horace, no way. I'm sorry, but I wasn't wrong. If you would look up, you'll see that it does indeed connect to the outside. And who's gonna climb this? Um... <laughs> um... Scholarly types do have a rather peculiar brand of humor, don't they? Say, this place is really weird. The whole chamber is steeped in magic. It must have taken a mage of tremendous power to make something like this. Oh. What's up? <laughs> Ooh, an old book. Look at the script. It's ancient. Lazarus Island. And there's a map of the island. I can't read anymore, I'm afraid. If only we had some kind of reference. There are books in the castle from the time of the first count. Perhaps if we went to the library? Either way, we can't stay here. Let's go back. I honestly thought we might find an exit. It's fine. We got some exercise. Better than being stuck in a cell. True. Plus I'm really looking forward to studying this book. Is this really the time to be getting so excited? Excited? I'm not the one who fell down a hole. Ah, uh, um... <laughs> Master Zale, you take this sunstone. You could probably put it to better use than I could. Judging their escape attempt a failure, Zale and the others return to their cell. Wake up, you! Feeding time! How was I? General Astor! You came to see us! Therius told me everything. You have been through quite the ordeal. However, Master Dagron is working hard to clear your name with the Count. You must be patient. Thank you for your concern. Although I must say, bringing Lady Callista to the Gorak base was rather rash, wouldn't you agree? You must have had a reason. Won't you tell me? I really can't tell him. Would telling the truth implicate the Lady Callista in some way, perchance? I'm very sorry, General. I'm really grateful that you came here, but I can't. It's fine, Master Zale. If you're so determined to stay silent, I think it's rather clear what's going on. In any case, you must not be so rash. Well, getting a little reckless now and then can be a good thing. Come, eat up. Let me know how it tastes. I do like to hear praise about my cooking. <laughs> I 
What? Is that true? If you would like, my lord, I can present you with all of the evidence. You surely do not understand the significance of this yourself. I can't say I haven't heard a few rumors, but I'm not so foolish as to try and dig through the secrets of a powerful man like you. Hmm. You are a wise man. But Lord Jural seems hell-bent on proving the boy's guilt. What can we do? I just might have a few ideas, my lord. Such as? When are we going to get out of here? Seriously. It can't end like this. Need... Uh, booze... Uh, need... The guard came three times while you were away. Actually, he's really nice once you get chatting to him. He even, uh, forgot that you were gone. Isn't that nice? <laughs> so that's how you get all those girls to give you the time of day. A lot's changed here since the current Count arrived. If anyone said... He's been to... but it's all lying. He'd rather that one. Not a decent one. I'm getting really hungry. <laughs> <laughs> 